I totally just tripped on my yarn getting up from the couch to get more coffee. <laughs> Anyways, good morning. It is Wednesday, December 11th, so day 11 of Vlogmas. I've been up for uh, maybe an hour and a half. I just decided to take it easy, drink some coffee, work on my sweater. Um, I didn't get the yesterday's episode uploaded on time, obviously. I just let it load up while I was sleeping and then I published it this morning. So I'm just taking it easy. I'll show you guys my sweater one moment. So here's sleeve number one. So it's supposed to have these little dots like probably up to here, but I was afraid to run out of my contrast yarn so the light gray. So I didn't add those. So here it is. And this is where I'm at. I'm starting to do the more solid bit. So I'm kind of starting to do this part here. So I'm going to be done. I think relatively soon. I'm sick of the socks. So they're on a timeout right now. I think I can probably work on those at work this weekend. So I'm uh, going to keep knitting, watch some more vlogmas, drink some more coffee, and then I'll get to work eventually. I'm procrastinating. Here are the hand salves. I checked on them last night, but the light wasn't great. So they're hard. I don't want to, you know, dig into them because I'm going to give one of them away. So I'll let that person pick out which one she wants. So this one is the cocoa, the cocoa butter with the lavender, and this one is the shea butter with the eucalyptus. It only took me nine years to figure out that I could come to this backstage hallway where it is relatively quiet and have my break. Nine years, what the heck? Because trumpets are loud. I was in the last little video but check what I've done it's really hard to put down it's only 70 stitches in a round I think something like that so I'm having a hard time putting it down it's just it's quick and it's just one more row just one more row if you're a knitter you know what this is like so I really need to get some work done now um, Hopefully I can get it done pretty fast and then I'll maybe make some more coffee. <laughs> I'm so addicted. It's funny. Um, yep, that's it. I'm gonna get work done. I also forgot to show you guys this little guy on, was it Tuesday night that I did my tree with Connie? Anyways, I took this little guy out. Isn't he cute? That's another one of Jacob's little school projects. Makes me smile. I'm a really bad plant mom. Look how dry this is. I water my plants maybe once a month. I just always forget and then I'll walk by one and see how dry it is and then I'll water it. I'm not sure how they're still alive. Look at this little lady that my son made me years ago. She's sitting cross-legged. She has knitting needles. She's adorable.
little break to show you guys all the snow. It's so pretty. It's gonna be fun to drive in this later because I'm going into town for dinner. I'm gonna have some Thai food. Oh, and I'm wearing my favorite sweatshirt again. All right, back to work. Just wanted to do my Willy check-in before I put my coat on and head into town. Um, I wonder what the roads are like. Anyway, this is my Nicola hat. This is a pattern that I designed. Uh, I have a green version as well. It has like this really interesting closure at the top. Um, I am wearing the, I think it's a one by one rib. It's a free pattern on Ravelry. I have a, I made a couple of these and then my friend Dennis stole one. It was more like fall colors and I got the purple one. And then I'm wearing my Sunset Highway that I made, just two colors, no sleeve color work. And then I'm wearing some, some, oh, it's Nomadic yarn, striped yarn. Hang on one sec. Here are the socks. They're actually, oh, I'm trying to do this so you can see the sparkle. I don't know why everybody, when you take a sock shot like this, that sounds really bad, sounds dirty. Anyway, when you take a sock shot from here, everybody always looks like they have oddly shaped feet and fat ankles. Anyway, these are my socks for today. I'm gonna hit up now. Clean off the car. I wanted to show you my mittens. I know it's dark, but Bear with me. They are just 100%, you know, like farm wool that I dyed with Kool-Aid. And my sister and I have matching mittens. It's pretty cute. And I also forgot to mention that this hat is made of wool folk fur and the Shibui silk cloud. And it's probably the warmest hat I've ever owned in my life. So I know it's kind of an expensive hat, but I love it. waiting this place is the best Thai in town all right I have the food I can't wait to eat I'm super hungry and this food here is amazing um, I think I'm gonna cut it here tonight and try and upload it when I'm at their house cuz their internet's probably faster than mine <laughs> so I'm gonna say good night and I will talk to you guys in the morning.